So today we will be connecting an Aotex Z-Wave Multisensor 6 with a Samsung SmartThings hub. When you buy an Aotex Z-Wave Multisensor 6, the box will contain the following items. The Aotex Z-Wave Multisensor 6, a battery cover, a back mount arm, double-sided tape, two screws, a micro USB cable, and a product manual. As you can see here, there are also two slots for two CR123A batteries. So the Aotex Z-Wave Multisensor 6 receives its power by either plugging the micro USB cable in the sensor and the power socket, or via two CR123A batteries, which are not by default included in the box. We open our SmartThings app on our mobile device. We tap on the right top menu button, and in the menu we tap on Add Thing. We tap on Connect Now. The SmartThings Hub LED will blink green, indicating that it is in pairing mode. We first power up the Aotex Z-Wave multi-sensor via either a micro USB or by inserting two CR123A batteries. We proceed by pressing on the action button on the Aotex Z-Wave multi-sensor. The SmartThings app will indicate that it has found the Aotex Z-Wave multi-sensor and that the pairing process has been successful. We tap on Aeon Multi-Sensor 6. We tap on Next. We tap on Done. We have hereby successfully paired the Aotex Z-Wave multi-sensor with the SmartThings Hub.